Welcome back YouTube. Uh, this is the final phase as you can see of the test experiment for the lemon etching of a circuit board. Now that means obviously what I was saying in the other videos taking a lemon, just the juice of the lemon, uh, obviously take your seeds out in your uh, pulp um, and hydrogen peroxide and it's a 50-50 mix on those as well as uh, table salt. Um, you might want to experiment obviously you put a little more bit of uh, salt in there and um, you're talking about uh, speeding up the reaction a little bit or, you know, helping it along a little bit better. Um, obviously, I've cleaned up a little bit on the board. It's not the most perfect method. Uh, a lot better than the vinegar and hydrogen peroxide and salt mixture, I think. Um, obviously, if you're going to be using a permanent marker like a Sharpie, you want to make sure that you retrace your lines and just make sure they're really solid. Uh, if you don't, obviously, you're going to get pitting and what have you, but um, here's proof right here that uh, obviously you can etch a circuit board using, like I said, a lemon, hydrogen peroxide, and salt. I hope this helped. Uh, I'm sure there's going to be a lot of scrutiny and comments and what have you. Uh, feel free to, you know, send me some questions and what have you, and uh, I'm going to be doing some more videos on uh, a toner transfer of this exact uh, procedure, and that'll obviously be a lot better as far as the trace lines, but the fact is, a lemon, hydrogen peroxide and salt will definitely uh, take copper off the circuit board and etch it for you. And uh, I hope this helps y'all. Thanks and uh, thanks for watching.